add some difficulty points to your Mega Loop with the Mega Loop Back Roll. Spice up the move even more by going inverted. Be sure to safely stick the Mega Loop before attempting a back roll while executing the Mega Loop back roll. Just like in a regular Mega Loop, go fast and aim for the highest jump possible. Immediately after leaving the water, roll over your back shoulder by turning your head in the designated direction. Don't go into the rotation with too much momentum. Do a slow back roll in order to prevent over rotating and losing balance in the air. While starting the back roll, steer the kite into the loop by tilting the bar fully against your riding direction. The pull of the Mega Loop will help you to rotate through the back roll. As the kite pulls, it has a tendency to accelerate your rotation. After the kite has completed its rotation, slightly release the bar so the kite can fly overhead to catch you for a smoother landing. As soon as the kite has caught you again and is back above you, pull the bar in slightly and keep your kite in motion for landing. Land the jump like a traditional mega loop on a downwind course while keeping the kite in motion. For more style, bring the board over your head. Timing is the key to success, so don't initiate the kite loop too early or too late. Let's check out the kite movement in detail one more time. Let's remember the key elements. Aim for the highest jump possible. Immediately after leaving the water, roll over your back shoulder and initiate a back roll. Steer the kite into the loop and await the pull of the kite to finish the rotation. Release the bar and land on a downwind course while keeping the kite in motion. Enjoy your ride with the Duotone Kiteboarding Academy.